answer the chapel reflection and they they are healthy and don't get the coronavirus in your name we pray amen friends do you still remember what is our school theme for this year our school theme for this year is car sleeper plane what does Christ we proclaim means? Christ we proclaim means because of His grace, we must tell about Jesus to everyone around us so they can know Jesus and glorify His name. Example, as a student, I must obey teachers and doing Christ we proclaim means we share Jesus' love to people who haven't heard about Jesus. I want to say and act like Jesus' disciples so people can more know about Jesus. I want to my free friends believe in Jesus and God. Thank you, friends, for reminding us about the meaning of Christ we proclaim. Today's story, Miss Mary is going to tell you about a story of someone who had been proclaiming Christ throughout all of her life. Her name is Lutimun. Lutimun has been called by God to be a missionary. A missionary is someone who carries a special mission. Hmm, what kind of special mission is that? Let us hear a quick explanation from our friends after this. Hi friends! We will explain what the job of missionary is. It is! A missionary is someone who there is a very special mission. Missionary are all Christians being called to complete a special mission. Mission is what Jesus had command in Matthew 28, 19-20. Go therefore and make disciples of all the nations, baptizing them in the name of the Father and of the Son and of the Holy Spirit, teaching them to observe all things that I have commanded you. A missionary doing the mission to tell people about Jesus and how much he loves them. Missionary mission is also inviting people who never heard about Jesus to get to know him for themselves. Jesus wants to tell people the and how much he loves them. However, there are many people who do not know Jesus yet. This is the job of us as Christians to share news about Jesus. There are some easy ways for us to be a missionary today by praying for someone to meet Jesus or giving the Bible to someone. Those are the job of the missionary as well as our job as a Christian. But Bless us to be missionary. Bless you. Thank you, friends, for explaining us about the job of the missionary. This is Liti Moon. She was born in states from a wealthy Christian family. She wasn't believing in Christ at first until one day when she attended a church service. At that time, her life was changed completely, and she trusted Christ and dedicated her life and was baptized. Luthi prayed and asked God, God, how can I serve you? Then God called Luthi to be a missionary in North China. At that time, there were many people who didn't know but Christ. Do you think Luthi was afraid to leave everything she had? No. 
Luti then went to China. She lived in a little crossroads. She dressed like a Chinese, learned how to speak like Chinese, and practiced their custom so that people would trust her and see her as a friend. She also baked cookies and put them out for children. Many of Chinese become her friends and listened when she told them about Jesus and his love for them. Isn't it amazing guys, the life of Luti Moon? God has changed Luti's heart and called her to be a missionary to the people in northern China. Have you asked God how he wants you to serve him like Luti? Do you want to start sharing God's goodness in your life to all of your friends around you right now? chapel this morning. Hopefully, the story of Luti Moon can inspire all of us to never be afraid to proclaim Christ in whenever or wherever God put us, us right now. Now, we want to close our chapel with a prayer. Let us pray together. Dear Heavenly Father, we thank you so much for all of your blessing. Thank you for the story that we have listened about Luti Moon, the one that you have been called to be a missionary to tell all of the people in Northern China about you. Lord, please help all of us to be brave like Luti Moon, to not be afraid to tell people around us about you and about your goodness in our life. Pray for our family to always put their faith on you. And please pray also for all of the missionaries out there. Please provide everything that they need so that they can share the goodness of you to all people that never been heard about you. This is our prayer, Lord. In your name we pray. Amen. Thank you for today. I will see you in another chapel. Bye.